Snow, Goochland, done with snow. This is Northern Dinwiddie. Got a Ann and Dale Carter sent this to me. Um, in Northern Dinwiddie, they're even getting a little snow. It is not, it is not going to last very long, and I don't think it's going to stick on the roadways in Dinwiddie County, but it is sticking in a lot of spots. And I got some great information coming into my Facebook page. You know, it's changing over to Colonial Heights, Churchill, the city's getting some snow. This is now. If you've got friends and family that are sleeping late, they're going to miss it. In fact, look at the city's camera. We've been showing our Troutman Pepper camera all morning. Now there's no snow here. And so although there may be another little burst for a few minutes, I don't think the city of Richmond's getting any more snow accumulating than what we've seen so far. There's another little line that has to go through and we'll look at that on the radar picture. So a little break in the action here. Maybe this line kind of fills back in. That's in Western Cumberland, excuse me, Western Ch uh, Chesterfield. Cumberland's now dry. Um, Eastern Amelia, Eastern Nottaway, Dinwiddie catching that snow. A little break now, but this is a sign that dry air is coming into this system and along Interstate 95 and West, any additional accumulation will be basically nothing. We still though, and I think for about the next hour through about six or maybe even 630, we're going to keep getting some of this accumulating snow on the east side of Interstate 95. So our areas, we often think of the snow piling up most north and west of town, but it's this northeast portion. Those of you in the northern neck and middle peninsula, be really careful over the next few hours. Could be some slick spots as the snow, not for the next few hours. Let's say as the snow could keep coming down for another hour or so. And we're talking about sunrise being the end of this. 33 in Tappahanna temperatures are near the freezing point, and we had pouring rain yesterday. The snow is kind of eating up my time and not letting me talk about how much rain we had yesterday. Many areas had three inches of soaking rain yesterday. Today, 49, so six in the morning. I think Richmond's rain, uh, rain or snow chance is very low. And during the day, it's totally sunny. It'll be breezy. It will be much cooler than yesterday. Yesterday, we went all the way up into the 60s, and there's nothing like that on the seven-day forecast. It's basically seasonable weather, appropriate for December. Upper 40s or low 50s for highs. Overnight lows are going to be colder than normal, I think, for the next week, down in the 20s. So we're going to have... Uh, Let's say sub freezing mornings every morning this week after this morning. Um, and again, that rain or snow that's falling now should be gone over the next hour or so. And we'll get a lot of sunshine for the week. Friday, low 50s. That's our verified best of the week. But a lot of the days here are going to be quite similar. Ashley, over to you. All right, Andrew, we'll have another update from you and Candace here in less than 10 minutes. Thank you.